and welcome to this week's edition of the Estes Park News Weekend Report. I'm Chris Hazelton. This Saturday and Sunday is the Sunrise Rotary Club's Autumn Gold Festival featuring beer, brats, and bands. The fest takes place in downtown Bond Park and will be fun for the entire family with kids' activities, food, live music, and the chance to win a $5,000 grand prize. Next weekend, there's two special events. First off is Vintage Market Days with vendors arriving from all over the country bringing their best handcrafted and vintage merchandise. The show will feature original art, antiques, clothing, jewelry, handmade treasures, and all things upcycled, refurbished, and reused. The show takes place Friday through Sunday at the Event Center at the Fairgrounds. The first weekend in October is also the time to enjoy Estes Park's very own Elk Fest as we celebrate these majestic animals now in the middle of the rut. The festival includes an elk bugling contest, the Rut Run 5K, a craft beer garden, and you can even meet real wolves or some amazing raptors. There will also be elk related arts and crafts, food, and much, much more. Families for Estes will host Pumpkins and Pilsners Saturday, October 8th with a pumpkin patch, live music, kids activities, and all the adults enjoy craft brewed seasonal beers. October 8th and 9th is also the Fall Celebration Sidewalk Sale hosted by our downtown merchants where you'll find special sales all throughout town. For our weekly wildlife report, the elk rut continues to be a main attraction in town, especially at the Nine Hole Golf Course where crowds gather to watch this amazing event in nature. The bears continue to try to fatten up for the winter months and have been seen getting into trash around town. It's a good time to remind everyone to be bear aware, keep your trash in a secure place until pickup day. We'd like to recognize our business of the week, the Egg and I, located on East Elkhorn Avenue. The perfect place to enjoy breakfast or lunch and make sure to try out some of their new refreshing fruit coolers. Thanks for watching the Estes Park News Weekend Report. I'm Chris Hazelton. We'll see you back here next week.